everyone, this is Michaela from Superfood Fairies and welcome to High Vibe Living. We're here at Baja Biosana in beautiful California del Sur, Mexico. Biosana is an amazing sustainable educational and healing arts community and here we are today at the outdoor kitchen where I'm going to show you how to make some delicious flaxseed crackers. And yes, there are a lot of recipes out there for flaxseed crackers, but I am sure that none of you have seen a dehydrator like the dehydrator we have here at Biosana. So first we're gonna make the sauce for the crackers. And we're going to make a curry coconut flaxseed cracker. I have all of the ingredients here in the Vitamix that we're gonna blend up. And I'm going to show you what's in the sauce. So I've got some amazing tomatoes that were harvested here in the garden at Biosana, some dates, some curry powder, some sea salt. I've also got some um, coconut flakes, cayenne, some olive oil, and some basil. And I'm gonna pour in a little bit of water We're going to blend this up. The secret to making amazing flax crackers is always in the sauce. Really? So if you look over here, we have some flax seeds that I soaked about 12 hours. And here are some chia seeds. And I'm also adding in some sunflower seeds and some pepitas, which are local pumpkin seeds. So they're a little larger in their shape. So if you watch what I do here, I'm taking chia and I'm mixing it in with the flax. And I'm also going to add a bunch of these seeds, mixing it in. Add a little more and it's nice to have um, these big chunky seeds showing up and creating a beautiful texture to the cracker. And then we're going to take the sauce, so watch this. Mmm, and we're mixing the sauce and you can see how the sauce is turning the crackers into this beautiful gold and orange color. So we don't have traditional um, dehydrator trays here at Biosana, so I found these trays that could almost make these like a small pizza crust. So I'm just putting this on here and we're going to actually, when I'm finished, we're going to take it out to the dehydrator and let it dry. So check out this amazing dehydrator. Before I came here I'd never seen anything like this. No electricity needed. And I'm going to put the tray right here. And there's plenty of sun, as you can see, and we'll be back in a couple hours to see how it's doing. Wow, you guys, check out these beautiful crackers. They're so gorgeous. These are the ones that I made in the dehydrator. And uh, I'm going to plunk some of this guacamole on there. Well, the cameraman's been so fabulous today. He's one of the community members here. I'm going to have to give him this. We'll see what he says. Here you go. It was worth the work. An explosion of flavors is just going off in my mouth right now. Very well done. Thank you, Michaela. Mmm. It is a total explosion of flavors. It's kind of like Mexico meeting East India. You got the guacamole and the Mexican flavoring, and then you have the cracker with all those Indian spices. Totally delicious. So yeah, you guys, that's it for now. I'm flying out on La Manana and I'm heading back to California. So stay tuned to High Vibe Living and I'll see you soon.